How did it go down? Thank you. I wrote it. <laughs> this is how nervous I get. <laughs> so um, we're going to open up with some prayer, and if you all bow your heads, Mr. Rosal is going to lead us in prayer. All right, let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much uh, for uh, just one, Lord. Thank you for the gift of Jesus Christ, crucified, buried, and risen. And uh, Lord, thank you for these kids working really hard uh, and, and really, Lord, pouring their hearts. Thank you for these kids. They're a gift to us. They're a blessing. Thank you, Lord, for the families here represented. Lord, thank you for bringing all these families here to support these, these beautiful kids, they're amazing, Lord. So, uh, Lord, I just pray that you would just um, uh, really just may your presence be here. Uh, your Holy Spirit be with us, Lord. We want to really celebrate, Lord, that Jesus Christ uh, became a man to save sinners like us. Thank you, Lord. And we want to reflect that in this play. In Jesus' glorious name, amen. 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 That actually does um, start where I le left off where I need to start up, and that is that um, the message, we are, of course, celebrating the birth of Jesus, but most of all what we're con um, commemorating is that that was the beginning of the salvation plan that we are in right now. We're waiting for that second coming. The Lord, you know, we're just, he came as a baby, and we want to remember that's the reason for the season. And we're here to celebrate it, but also um, in remembrance of the fact that we're in that plan and we're waiting for the end. Breaking news! Breaking news! There was just a great excitement captured on a video by a nearby witness. Young Mary, you know the one betrothed Joseph the carpenter, seen hanging out with angels just minutes ago here in Lazarus. Take a look for yourself at this footage. Wedding plans, wedding fans. So much to do. Can you believe it? Rent the hall? Check. Buy the dresses? Check. Order the food? Check. Joseph buy the rings? I better go check. <laughs> Have it straight from the MP4. Hey, look, there she is. Let's see if we can get an interview from her and see what the encounter was all about. Some evening news here. We came. We came to see if we can get an interview from you and see what the enca uh, encounter was all about. Um, wait, I forgot my lines. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with that? Who is he? Do you meet here often? What did he have to say? Am I on the news? Wow! Hi, everybody. Hi, mom. Hi, dad. Hi, Joseph. So, Mary, what's the deal? I don't really know. I never saw him before in my life. He just appeared. He was chill, though. But what he had to tell me was not so chill. He sounded good of a baby. Not that I was planning such a quick birth after getting married. But here's the deal. Now I'm good of a baby before I'm married. And it's not Joseph's. It's God's. Wish me luck. I'm on the way to tell Joseph. <laughs> Hi, Joe. What's going on? Well, you tell me. You're a little bit behind the news. A pretty lap of right to go that 
You've been cheating on me. What are you talking about? I have not been cheating. Do you expect me to believe what I hold on the news? Wait a second. What part do you not believe? You believe that I'm pregnant because the news said so, but you don't believe that it's God's child, which you also heard on the news. Can you make up your mind? I'm not ready for this. <laughs> Joseph. Bro, believe it. The kid's mine. The chick is telling the truth. Man, ye little faith. Highlights of what is going on in the nation to follow the weather. Pretty chill in Israel. The capital of Tel Aviv is a coastal friendly temperature of 72 degrees. The Jordan River off the West Banks is calm good fishing. That is if you're not fishing for men. The West Banks in itself is a little hostile to that activity currently. The political temperature is hot, hot, hot right now. That's all we got on the weather today. Nice clear night, plenty of stars to light the skies. Back to you, the national news. Thank you for the update. We will be in either of those clear skies and good weather as the nation has been placed in a mandate to be all to all return to their birth cities to be counted. That's right. It's been ordered by Caesar for everyone to return to their birth cities to be counted and taxed. So pack your bags and hop in the car and move on out. And don't forget where you're going first. Always the latest breaking news, Jerusalem Evening News. Safe travels and good night. Remember, you can tune us in no matter where you are in the nation. So it wakes you up in the middle of the night. So I've hard to forget after that. But anyway, I got it straight now. And God has made a way for us all to go down in a good way. I have to go to Bethlehem because of sense. And so we can both go and we'll have a baby there and we'll live there. I don't really know. My mom will kill me if I try that. They are so mad for what I told them yesterday. I'm pretty sure I'm grounded for the rest of my life. I'm sure if they don't let you go, God will change their minds. He did with me. Here we are in the center of Bethlehem, and the town is buzzing with excitement. Evidently, people don't normally live here long. They have their children, then move on. Now that our nation has been placed in a mandate to be all counted and taxed in their birth cities, this little town is bursting at its seams. Check out the latest incident right here in this little city. Roll him, Sam. No vacancy. No vacancy. Vacancy. <laughs> I know what is the signs of vacancy. You must take one of these. Register here. I'll show you what I have. <laughs>
believe it? People sleeping in stables? Not just sleeping there, but having babies there. What is this world coming to? We will keep you updated as we search the cities for more happenings. Jerusalem Evening News, signing out. Man, it was so hard to come to work tonight. So many new girls in town. Yeah, I just wanted to go out. Maybe I could find myself a ride. You want to get married? Not on my agenda. I'm going for the single life. I was just glad that I could get here before all the jobs were gone. I was worried. By the way, what's it like if you're at night? Pretty chilly, I would imagine. Yeah, people never come up here. People never come up here. Not since the guy that kept on crying, Wolf. He did it so many times that I have someone to talk to. Now ain't nobody coming up here. You cry, Wolf. Did somebody say Wolf? Yeah, we should be getting hazardous pay. It's not our fault people want to come to our rescue. Whatever happened to him? I don't know. Just the spirit one night. <laughs> there were the song of the shepherds go lay away. He goes out. Evening news on the scene. We came out to see what the commotion was about at the innkeeper's hotel. Just before midnight, we received a call about some happening um, commotion going on in these tables. It is more than words can give justice. Take a look for yourself. Oh. He's beautiful. That is good. Maybe. This ghost keeps messing my fitting. Shoo, shoo, get out of here. 
Dude, I gotta see the little man. I knew it was supposed to leave the city tonight. more than words can say, but let's get a bystander's view of tonight's happenings. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. What do you think about all the things that were going on here tonight in Bethlehem? It had to happen. God had to send someone to clean up this mess we made down here. But a baby? Have you not been paying attention? This is not just a baby. This is God's son, Jesus, the King of Kings. Well, you heard it right here, and the final words are, Jesus is God, and he was sent onto the earth to die for our sins. Good night and God bless.
that your baby boy would one day walk on water. Mary, did you know that your baby boy would save our sons and daughters? Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you new? This child that you delivered will soon deliver you. Mary, did you know that your baby boy would decide to a blind man? Mary, did you know that your baby boy would calm the storm with his hands? Did you know that your baby boy has walked in? The blind will see, the deaf will hear, the dead will live again. The lame will leap, the dumb will speak, the praises of the land. Mary, did you know that your baby boy is Lord of all creation? Mary, did you know that your baby would one day rule the nations Did you know that your baby boy Is heaven's perfect land This sleeping child you're holding Is the great I Can I please ask Mr. Rosales, are you still in the house, if you could close us in prayer? Thank you very much, everybody, for coming to our performance. Um, I know I didn't get to announce the raffles, but we do have um, raffles up here for the needy families in our community. And um, if you still wanted to buy some tickets, we will have them for, for sale after the performance. I would say encore, but we have to go home. Uh, but uh, we're proud of you guys. Great job. Uh, you guys really please the Lord. Uh, let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much, Lord, uh, for just family. Uh, thank you so much for these children. They're such a blessing uh, to the school, to uh, really, Lord, to uh, their families. I know, uh, Lord, thank you that you just really gave them wisdom and the ability to perform to glorify you most of all, Lord. So thank you. Uh, bless the families as everyone goes home. And Lord, uh, we just offer this as a worship as a, as a, to you, Lord. Thank you so much. Bless us. Keep us. Shine your face upon us and be gracious to us. In Jesus' glorious name, amen. amen. One big shout out to all the staff and everybody who's helping.